Welcome to another episode of Trailer Chicks. For a few days, we're going to be out on Sobeys Island, which is just outside of Portland. This island is known for great fishing, an abundance of wildlife, and beautiful farm fresh produce. Our first stop is the Pumpkin Patch, where we'll meet Carrie, one of the farmers. Carrie, yes, hi, thanks for coming today. Yeah, thanks for having us. We're really excited to uh, see what's in season, get some amazing produce, and um, check out this farm. Good, I'm so glad you came. We just opened for the season. So Carrie, can you tell me a little bit about the pumpkin patch and how long it's been here and what you specialize in? Yes, we've been here for over 40 years. Wow. My husband and I for 20, his parents 20 years before that. We grow 50 different fruits and vegetables. We're known for selling things in bulk at um, farm direct prices. Um, so we start with berries, strawberries, raspberries, marionberries, blueberries, and end with pumpkins. And as the season goes on, more and more produce is available. So fresh produce, I think we're known for second to just pumpkins. Carrie, I couldn't help but notice all these gorgeous baskets all around the store, and I was just wondering how they fit in with the produce market. Okay, yeah. So our family traveled to Rwanda the last two Februarys. Wow. And um, we were asked actually to go um, to help plant seeds for two orphan schools. It's the only business that they have there. So it's another way to support um, the women in this village in Rwanda, Africa. So That's the great. seeds are uh, already growing. We've seen the produce, we've seen the harvest, and it's so exciting to add vegetables to the people's diets where they mostly eat beans and cornmeal. Oh wow. Well Britta would you like to go shopping now? Should I would. I'd love to pick out some produce for some great recipes I'm going to show. Oh I love these radishes. Yeah the French um, or icicle radishes. I like the red and white to add color to a salad. Or... And they're usually pretty mild aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. So these would be great in a I'm going to make a strawberry salsa and onions. Do you have any sweet oh, onions? yes. How about um, Walla Walla salad onions? These are from Sobe Island. Those are the best sweet onions. Yes. We're so lucky to be in the region for these. I love to put those on the grill too. Oh, fresh kale. Kale would be perfect for smoothies. I'm going to make smoothies and it's a great way to get your greens. Oh, and here's our rhubarb, so we only grow. All right. I'm going to mix this with strawberries and make a really good crisp. And this is what I'm so excited about. Oh, yes. Fresh strawberries. There's nothing like an organ strawberry. Um, you know, you got to get them while they're in season. It's a short season, two weeks. Carrie, thank you so much for showing me around and getting all this great produce. I can't wait to get in the trailer and make some amazing recipes. And you'll have to be sure and stop by and see what we make. Can't wait. All right, thanks. Uh -huh.